All right, back here at the Manitoba Sports Hall of Fame, Rick Brownlee joining us once again. And Rick, a uh, dinner not too long ago, officially inducting the class of 2016 into here. So let's kind of go through who is uh, the newest inductees into the Hall of Fame. Let's begin uh, with the list of athletes going in. Sure, the 37th annual induction dinner, we held it last November. And the five athletes, um, we had uh, Jim Heighton as an all-round, uh, a lot of old Bomber fans will remember him from the 70s, but he was a heck of an athlete in four or five different sports. Um, Alana uh, Yakachuk Heinrichsen was a 400 meter sprint champion um, and she was put in for athletics. We had Rhiannon Lear Blatcher, a two time Olympian in swimming. And um, we had Mike Keane, of course, uh, three time Stanley Cup champion. And uh, we also had Joey Johnson, who was inducted for wheelchair basketball. And Joey's a three time gold medalist in uh, Paralympic uh, wheelchair basketball. A good crop for sure. Uh, some builders going in as well. Who are they? Uh, the builders, um, we had uh, Cal Botterill, Dr. Cal Botterill, um, for sports psychology, so our first sports psychologist to be inducted. And uh, he joins his speed skating wife, Doreen, who was inducted 21 years earlier. So uh, great, great to have Cal in. And he touched so many lives of uh, different Olympic athletes, over 10 different Olympic games, worked for five NHL teams, so really an impressive resume. And our first inductee for the sport of rugby, uh, an inaugural inductee in John Kiwi Riley. The late uh, John Riley was the founder of the Brandon Barbarians uh, Rugby Club, and uh, we were really glad to add him. And sometimes teams are so good that you got to induct the entire team, so there's a couple of those going in as well this year? There, there is, yeah. Um, we had the 1985 Bob Ursel uh, curling team, which was the first uh, world junior champion out of Manitoba. And um, we had all of them in here. Uh, most of them live in BC. And we had um, Gerald Chick come all the way in from Australia, where he lives now, uh, with his son to join us for that evening. And uh, the big wrap up on the evening was the 1971 to 74 University of Winnipeg Westman, who won four consecutive CIAU National Volleyball men's titles. All right, there it is, the class of 2016. Rick, thank you so much for this. Now, speaking of Manitoba legends, Mike Valente coming up next. No, I'm not talking about Mike, the Manitoba legend, but the person he's interviewing, Mike Valente, one-on-one -on -one with Fred Penner.